From the moment I met Alex Stobbs, I just knew we were going to get on. Age 16 and a music scholar at Eton, I began filming him as he started work on the biggest musical challenge of his life, to conduct one of the world's great choral masterpieces, Bach's Magnificat. I think it's going to be incredible. You simply weren't looking up any of you, OK? Just do it again. You need to practice. You have to watch that. Just practice. Do it. We need OK. To if I was really concentrating, I would get a triple 20 every three. Feisty, unstoppable, and a brilliantly gifted musician. If anybody could do it, Alex could. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> awful. <laughs> My plan was to film him over two months as he prepared to put on a concert in Eaton's Chapel. I had no idea what would happen along the way, but one thing I did know, with Alex as my subject, it was going to be quite a ride. Hopefully the bloody might work. But what made the challenge truly remarkable is that Alex has cystic fibrosis, a disease which could any day cut short his life. What is this we're looking at? Um, this is a week's supply of Alexander's medication, and that's both during the day and night time. And this is all stuff that's going to school? Yep. How long so, will that stuff you've got in there last for? Oh, you know? not very long. Maybe a couple of weeks, something like that. That's um, an average of tablets and capsules he takes a day. How many pills do you take a day? At least 50. Um, I'm used to it, so... Uh, I mean, I set myself challenges as to how many I can take in one go. <coughs> <coughs> Alex was born with cystic fibrosis, a disease which attacks the pancreas and the lungs, filling them with a thick mucus, a breeding ground for potentially fatal infections. Three times a day, he needs intensive physiotherapy to get rid of the mucus, but his is an extreme case, and the disease is slowly destroying his digestive system, his bones, and above all, his lungs. Alex is one of Eaton's musical stars, where his talents won him a scholarship at the age of 13, paying his fees. Although he's never managed to complete a full term, the school has kept him on, even giving him a scooter to help him get round the ancient buildings. Have you ever hit a boy on uh, it, or, or a master? Yeah, I've hit a boy. What I love about Eaton is something's always going on. In the last few weeks of the holidays, I'm always itching to get back, to get involved. Whatever you like doing, there's always something, something going on. These doctors have known him for years and years and, and know that they want him to do things and I really, I really think that's wonderful. We look at ourselves and say, well let's value what we've got, you know, it's, uh, what we've got is pretty good and uh, he helps us have that feeling. <laughs> 